Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of the Rust Solo series here on Rust Console Edition. I'm just going to remind you guys to make sure to subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed to the channel. Make sure to hit the notification bell button to be notified whenever I post another video. And if you find yourself liking this video at some point, make sure to smash that like button. It really does help out the channel a lot. And let's just get the episode started. Woo! Okay. So... We've been doing some remodeling. I actually found this glass. Honestly, to be honest with you guys, I've been gone for a couple of days. I've been farming off camera here and there as best as I can. We managed to get the base up and running as well as we thought. Um, sorry that this whole room is empty. Um, I put a T2 down here. And if you remember last time I upgraded this wall, I took it down. And then I guess long story short, um, I had ended up blowing up the T2. Um, yeah, it's a waste of things, but yeah, I mean, I gotta go get some wood. Um, when I blew this up, I blew up a lot of the, the things that I had here. I need to go get some wood. That way we could repair half the stuff that we lost. We need to put the extra chest. We need to replace the boxes that were up here. So that's going to be fun. All right. So I think what we're going to do is that we need to close all these doors. Now we got a shit ton of garage doors. And as a solo player, I did all of this. We finally got ourselves a locker and we were able to craft the actual, this gun right here. We were able to craft our little SAR right here. And then we got the coffee key, um, the coffee can helmet that we got in the last season. We were able to craft this as we had the VP. Unfortunately, I don't, I don't know how long season two is going to be. Um, population is low right now, so I feel a little safe to go out. Oh yeah, by the way, we got new neighbors. Um, yeah, as you can see, the neighbors have been moving in. They've placed like walls down. I kind of want to do that with my compound. I want to put those walls up like that. But unfortunately, I don't, I'm not having luck finding any of that stuff. Then again, I haven't really been doing monuments. I kind of been holding off on doing monuments until I was online again. And... Dude, I'm hitting the tree in the X. Why wasn't it going faster? All right, whatever. Anywho, um, kind of been waiting for you guys to be able to do some farming. Not farming, but um, farm some monuments. That way, I will show you if we get into some PvP. I've been trying to avoid PvP, so I've been doing mostly the boring stuff off camera. Yeah, let's get these trees over here. <clears throat> I want to build a shit ton of explosives and just raid somebody. Once it gets to like 11 o'clock, that's when usually pop hits up. So let's just kind of get all these trees going, get this metal cooking, get a T2 up again. I only have 300 scrap. I need 200 more. It shouldn't be that hard to get. I got a lot of stuff to melt down. So I'm thinking about going to the to the power plant to melt it down in that fern and the and the thing right there. And see where we go from there. Let me see how much stone. I, I mean stone. What am I saying? How much wood do I have? Okay, I got a decent amount. Decent amount for sure. It's funny because once people see that you're honeycomb, it's almost like they fuck off. Once people see that you have a honeycomb, they don't really try or bother to raid you. And holy shit. Oh, come on, dude, my gun's faulty. Fuck, dude, my gun fucking failed. Shit. Damn it. All right. We're right there. Maybe we could get this. Whew. There's nobody here, bro. Nobody's here. Are you fucking kidding me right now? You know what? That guy has full health. Fuck me. I had a lot of farm too. Damn it. This is the problem. This is the problem with having a lot of farm. All right. Well, we're about to lose the SAR. That guy had a custom too. Yeah, let's go out. <clears throat> we don't have any bandages or anything, so. All right, here we go.
It was up here. He picked up his friend, didn't he? Wow, dude, I really... Yo, I suck. <laughs> oh my god, I just got these guys paid out of their fucking mind. Now, before anybody says anything, yes, I suck with the SAR. I know, this is why I think a SAR is a cool weapon, but this is why I don't recommend the SAR to anybody that is a beginner. I am not good with the SAR. I'm good with any other gun, but the SAR, I just, I can't shoot SARS for the life of me, as you saw right now. And even, even that's why I literally said before this, I'm going to go outside and lose the SAR. Because I knew I'm not good with the SAR, but I, that's the most powerful weapon I had. And it was two of them. I should have just gone outside with the double barrel and I would have probably done more. The fact that I could have killed both of them, it, it kills me editing this video and knowing that... It, I know that some of you were probably like, oh my god, why? How did you miss? They were literally standing there. I know, man. I know. I just, I don't know what to say, man. I I, I, I suck with the SAR. I'm better at the, I'm better with other weapons, but the SAR. Damn, man. I just keep repeating myself, but it's the truth. Um, Now, this game, or I should say footage, took place they're in the pre-order beta so this was like last month um and the game actually while i was editing um i cut this footage out but i i literally said that the wipe is gonna happen on the 14th and then the 18th is the launch as of editing this video we're already in june so that just tells you it was over a month ago that this footage is old um i usually like to record my footage a little bit before so a lot of you have been asking me what are the monuments and everything Yes, I know that I usually don't intrude in the videos, but I decided to intrude this time because I've had a lot of people asking me, like, what's going on? How do you have these monuments and everything? So hopefully for those of you that have been following the series, you guys understand. For those of you that are new to the series, now you understand that it's not because I'm in the map specifically, but this is pre-order beta. The new series where I'm actually playing on the weekly servers that are currently out for crossplay and regular um, consoles that's going to be the new season and it is coming up probably in the next week so expect that to happen um other than that yes guys um don't try to use the sar unless you're not really a god with that thing <laughs> i don't know how to say it man i just i just I, the sar is not a gun that i like and whenever i see somebody using it for some reason people are just good with it i just i'm not good with that gun i just i i suck at it and as you've seen i do suck Wow. Okay. That's cool too. <sighs> I'm rusty as hell, man. This is what happens when all you do is farm. Damn it. I didn't expect these guys to be out here farming. <sighs> well, just last our chainsaw. That's fucking great. Damn it. And this is why... <laughs> I just really suck with the scar and I've literally know that I've kind of come to realize that little by little. I just I'm really bad with the SAR. SAR, scar, whatever the hell people want to call it. Here. Let's grab all this food. I feel like in hindsight I should just stick to um I mean the custom is just a, a custom just murders everybody. That's why I was trying to get myself a custom. I'm just really good with custom or the other one, the um the freaking Tommy. Those are my favorite ones. Sar, if you're good at that, you're murdering people left and right. But nothing beats a custom um, augmented. If you augment the freaking custom, dude, you're murdering everybody. Which, I'm pretty sure that guy has a custom augment. They had to have run back to base. I'm sure that they live in that giant compound right there. Here. Oh, it looks like they left my stuff here. Wow, they really... What the fuck? Did they not take my shotgun? I guess they didn't. 
I'm sure they only took my scar here and then just left. They did take my chainsaw though. Yeah, what'd I tell you guys? See? All right. Those guys have to live on that base. I just got him paid. Fuck my life, bro. Well, you win some, you lose some. And that was completely embarrassing. I shouldn't really post that, but I'm going to post it anyway because I want to show you guys that not every single time you're going to be successful. Here, let's put the, the stuff that we were... Did they only take half the bullets or did I really use that many? No, I didn't even use that much bullets. I guess they only took some bullets. Custom is just nasty, bro. That's what I need. Now we got space to walk around. Let's go. I have a shit ton of sleeping bags. If you guys are wondering why do I have so many sleeping bags? Because I was trying to increase my comfort level. When you have a high comfort level, it increases the chances of you... um. Sorry. When you have a high comfort level, it increases your health. You know, I mean, not increase it. You heal faster. So that's why I have it here. So I just step on my bed. I eat food and then it brings up my comfort level like so. You see, it sh if it brings it up to 100, it basically freaking heals you like crazy. I think it only brings it up to like 85% when I'm here. So if you have like three sleeping bags here and then you're standing right under a rug, like it brings it up to 100% for some reason. So that's why I had the three sleeping bags there. What am I looking? I'm looking for the metal. The metal that I'm supposed to be cooking. I brought all the stuff with me. Everything that I could bring, I brought it with me. Because I don't give a fuck. Look, look at this. Why would they toss that on the floor? That's cloth. So yeah, I came in here. We're going to be smelting a lot of this stuff. I don't want to smelt this down. I actually want to learn it. That way we could put it around the base. Um... We're going to be smelting a lot of this stuff, to be honest with you. So let's start. I want to smelt all of this shit to get some scrap. I need apparently 250 to learn this. And I want the maximum amount of scrap. That way I could come back home with some wood that I buy off the bandit cap. Yes, it has gotten to that point. I don't care anymore. I know I should be farming wood. But I'm just, I'm mad salty right now. I'm mad salty. I feel like um this wipe has not been the greatest for us. And this, I hope that this goes to show you that even if you have a bad wipe, just push through it. If you want, you could just switch to another server and try to have another wipe. You know, maybe you get better, a better wipe on another server. But for me, I have blueprints on this. So I was just like, I already committed to this. I'm already here. I might as well just do it. You know, like, why not? Even though it's not that hard to get blueprints, if you saw season one, it's not that hard to get blueprints. But oh my god, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you, we're having a bad wipe. <laughs> this season two has been, the PvP has been, and this is what we get. This is what we get because we decided to move into the desert. Because lo and behold, I thought, you know, the desert is a difficult place to live. We're not gonna see a lot of people. Oh boy, was I wrong. No, there's tons of people in the desert. And actually, it's most of them like big groups from what it seems like. So I decided to move next to the big groups. And I mean, you saw those two guys. They were both farming. I didn't even notice until they were farming. Uh, unfortunately, I, yeah, I mean, I'm going to sit here and complain all day. But I, I'm gonna, at the end of the day, it is my fault. I should have gone out with the with the scar basically that's why i'm melting down the scar uh, the semi-automatic bodies because honestly i'm like f this i don't i'm not really good with the scar um you know oh, sorry with the sar or however people call it but if i'm not really good at it what's the point you know what's the point of me trying to like use it um i mean i'll get better at it if i get one along the way then f yet i'll keep it but other than that nah i'm not, I'm not dealing with that no more i'm gonna stick to trying to get myself a custom and trying to work with the Tommy. Because I feel like the spray, the spraying, it's, it's so much easier for me. Like the Tommy and the custom spray seems to be a lot easier for me than just the uh, single shots. I feel like single shots are not my best work, my best area. So I think we're going to stick with that here. We're going to go ahead and continue to smelt. This guy right here, he's getting me um a little anxious. You know, like this guy right here, he's just... 
He's just like, hey, what you got there? It's like, as soon as I let go, he's going to just jump in and get everything. So that's why I have to stay in there. Because as soon as I detach from this, he's just going to go ahead and dip in there. I also brought the doors that we had that we switched for garage doors. Um, honestly, the reason why I brought the doors is because I might as well get some metal um, fragments out of it. As you can see, we're struggling with wood. So wood equals metal because you can smelt. So yeah, I just I, I was like, F it. I'll just bring the, the doors too. Might as well just bring him. We're not going to be building another base anytime soon. Um, I would have if the white wasn't happening in the next like 12 hours. So that's why I was like, yeah, no, there's no point. I might as well just, you know. Damn, even though I just grabbed everything out of the base and I came all the way straight here. And I just kind of only kept the things that I knew I wanted to keep to make like double barrels and things like that we got a lot of scrap out of this not as much as i would like it to be but just enough to like learn this stupid one wait each one of these gives us 75 oh no 30. all right here we go gears what each gear gives me high grade metal i didn't know that that's dope. All right, bro. You could go ahead. Who are you? What's your name? Noemi. There you go. He's an Xbox user. Hey, let's try to learn this. I wonder how much it's going to cost us. It's probably going to cost tons of wood, which I'm not looking forward to buying. Sorry, I'm not looking forward to farming. I think we're going to have to just take the chainsaw somewhere else. Because we're only going to be able to afford 2,000 wood. Right? Uh, let me see. Can I craft this? There it is. 1,500 per wall. Oh, jeez. All right, we have tons of metal. Which I'm actually excited about. We managed to turn all of that scrap into something else. So I think what we're going to do is the best thing we can do is jump on a boat. Um, take the chainsaw somewhere else and start farming over there. All right, ladies and gentlemen. And on that note, we are going to end the episode here. I'm just going to remind you guys to make sure to subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed yet. Make sure to hit the notification bell button to be notified whenever I post another video or a live stream. I like to live stream on this channel on Tuesday, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. I have seen a lot of you drop by and say hello. Thank you guys for those of you that actually drop by. For those of you that want to know when I stream, like I said, it's Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursdays. And it's usually after 8 p.m., I would say Eastern time. Um, just kind of like look up what is that on your like region, I would say. And until then, guys, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.